If sketch figures are not closed, you will not be able to use them to create 3D features later in the design process. If you do not have a closed sketch, you will see an error similar to this one when you try to use the sketch as a profile to create a feature. A closure error can be the result of a gap or an overlap in the sketch geometry. When you get this error message, you will need to fix the sketch. A click on the Show Me button brings up the Analyze Sketch dialog. Clicking on each of the results in the Type column causes the problem area to be highlighted. If there is a way for Libre Design to heal the error, the Heal button will become active so it can be selected for the appropriate fix. Otherwise, the message No Healing Option Available will be displayed in the Heal box and a manual repair will need to be performed. This example is easy to repair because the problem is so obvious. Using Trim Feature solves this problem. Now the Extrude Boss command works fine because the sketch is closed. Most of the time, the problem section is not so easy to locate. To check a sketch while in sketch mode, with the sketch active, go to the 2D Sketching ribbon tab and click the Analyze button on the ribbon bar located here. The items checked off in the dialog box are the items being checked. Click on the Analyze button to begin the analysis. If the analysis routine detects any issues with the sketch, these issues will be listed in the Results section in the dialog box. When you click on an item listed in the Type column, the details related to that particular issue will be displayed in the Heal section of the dialog box. If the issue is a gap in the sketch that falls within the specified tolerance, the Heal button will be active. Clicking on the Heal button will close the specified gap related to that particular issue. Any other listed issues that are not gaps falling within this tolerance zone will need to be manually resolved as in the previous example. This sketch is causing an error because of the extra line in the sketch. This line, if used in the real world, would be infinitely thin and would need to be deleted for the sketch to be used in the creation of a feature. You can see that in some cases a single sketch error may produce more than one problem notice. The open sketch issues are solved by erasing this line segment. In this example, sketch analysis reveals a short line segment superimposed on another line. Deleting the short segment solves the problem. This tutorial showed you how to analyze 2D sketches with the Analyze Sketch tool to detect geometry errors. You also learned how to fix and edit these errors so the 2D sketch can be used to generate 3D features.